Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Twitch tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to have your Twitch streams automatically saved to Twitch so then you can post them as highlights or download them and then upload them to YouTube later on. Now, by default, when Twitch saves your streams, they're only available for 16 days. And I'll also show you a trick that'll allow them to be saved permanently. So to get started with saving our streams on Twitch, the first thing we need to do is open up a browser and go to twitch.tv. Once you're there, go up into the top right, select your profile image to open the menu. And then in the menu, go down and select Creator Dashboard. Once you get to the Creator Dashboard for your Twitch channel, if the menu in the left sidebar is collapsed, go ahead and open it up by selecting the arrow at the top. And first, what we need to do is go down to Settings, select Settings, and then go down to Stream. So this is where you can get your stream key, things like that. Scroll down and go to VOD Settings, and you want to make sure that Store Past Broadcast is turned on. As you can see, it says automatically save broadcast for up to 14 days. If you're a partner or Prime user, it'll be 60 days. Also check the link in the description to see how you can get Prime for free. All right, so once you have this turned on, now whenever you stream to Twitch, your streams will automatically be saved to Twitch. To view those streams, all we need to do is go back to the Creator Dashboard and in the left menu, go down to Content, select Content, and then go to Video Producer. As you can see, I have one stream in here that was just a test stream. So I can click that, I can view it if I want to, just a short test. If you want to download the saved stream, simply select download right here and it'll allow you to download it to your computer. Also, if you want to unpublish the stream, you can select unpublish right here and that will remove it from being viewable to the public. So like I said, this video will only be available on your channel for 16 days. If you want to make it permanent, all we need to do is select highlight. This will bring up the highlight editor for that video. From here, we can change the title of it, change the game, and then at the bottom, we can clip the video if we want to. So if you want to have the entire thing, make sure that the yellow portion extends to the very beginning and end of the video. You can also drag that in to shorten the clip if you want to. Once you're done editing the video, if you need to, simply go down and select publish highlights. It's going to process that. Then once the video is done processing, simply select save in the bottom right and you'll be brought back to the video producer section where you'll then be able to see the video that was just created. One more thing before we end the video, your viewers are able to view your highlights by simply going to your Twitch channel, then in the menu, going to videos, and then under recent highlights, they will be able to see the highlights that you just created from your clips. All right, so that's how you save streams on Twitch and make them permanent. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Twitch tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials.